I picked as a designer Jan Kaplecki, class IDS 140, summer session 2015. And my name is Hannah Vesela. About his background, personal characteristic. He was born on April 18, 1937 and died in January 14, 2009. He was a world-renowned neo-futuristic Czech architect who spent more than 40 years of his life in the United Kingdom. Between 1956 and 1962, he studied at the College of Applied Arts and Architecture and Design in Prague, receiving a diploma in architecture. After the Soviet invasion of Czechoslovakia, he escaped to London in September 1968. He was the leading architect behind the innovative design office, Future Systems. Design characteristic, Jan Kaplitsky is a performer of a high-tech architecture. During last years of his life, he experimented with an organic architecture which is inspired by organic forms. He also cooperated with world-known architectures, for example, Richard Rogers or Norman Foster. Here is a few pictures of Jan Kaplitsky. After escaping to London in 1968, Kaplitsky first worked for Dennis Lasdem and Partners. In 1979, Kaplitsky set up his own architectural thing, Thank Called Futures, with David Nixon and began to develop an architectural style that combined organic forms with high-tech futurism. One time, Kaplitsky told uh, News Business Week a sentence which says more about his work. Where is written that buildings have to be boxes. People are in boxes. The best way how to understand Kaplitsky's philosophy is to read the following text. The Lord's Media Center. This is the first work that I picked. Lord's Cricket Crown. It's in London, uh, in the United Kingdom, and it was built in 1999. The uh, second one is Museo Casa Enzo Ferrari. Uh, it's in Modena, in Italy, and it was established in 2012. We can uh, see, again, the organic design. Uh, the Floating Bridge, it's in London, uh, built in 1996, and it provides the offices to access the shops and restaurant and gardens on the other side while still reinforcing the impression of the Docklands as a waterfront development instead of an isolated office park. The Selfridges building, the Glove, it's in Birmingham, built in 2003. Its form escapes the usual structure of edges and walls into a curved and rounded sculpture, we can say organic. Uh, not only its unique shape and discs, but also where, is it, where it is located. Uh, this department store was built based on Ten Commandments by Kaplitsky. Freedom, creativity, people, beauty, elegance, plasticity, sensuality, color, innovation, and inspiration. Here is my evaluation of his work. And here is my critique. We can see his uh, philosophy based on Ten Commandments. Also, we can see that his structures are basically built on an organic form. And here are a few references what I used in my project. Thank you for watching.